Hey guys, so I just want you to be aware because we will see that great outpouring of the Holy Spirit. I really, I really believe that. And we need to, you know, we need to be aware of the times that we're in because it's really easy for any of us to fall away because the pleasure of this world is irresistible. Um, being, in, being in control of your life, you know, um, going after your dream, your passion, that, you know, you're going to want to do that. The, you feel like, you know, you feel like you can be satisfied in this world, but you can't. Because you can only be happy through Jesus. And, you know, I tried to fill the void with worldly things, with um, fun things, you know, just like uh, sometimes doing videos, sometimes uh, watching videos, or just doing whatever the heck I want because it makes me feel good. But I'm not truly happy because the only happiness that is true is the happiness that you get through Jesus. I just want you to know that. So, um, just be alert. You know, just stay awake. Don't fall asleep. Don't, don't be like uh, people in church that, you know, they hear the message that goes in uh, one ear and out the other. Um, because there are a lot of people that, you know, they'll have their walk with Jesus on Sunday, and that's the end of it. All throughout the week, they do whatever the heck they want, they go wherever they want, but they're never going to truly be satisfied until they let Jesus into their hearts, because that is the way that you can fill that void in your life. There's a gaping hole in your heart, well, just let Jesus into your heart, because that is the only way that you'll be truly happy. So just be alert and keep on looking for that great outpouring of the Holy Spirit because it's coming soon. Right when you see young people in stadiums worshiping Jesus, you know it's it. Um, there are going to be people that are just watching that and you know they're going to be thinking that it's all crazy. These people have gone bonkers. Um, those are the people that are going to deny that outpouring and not going to be a part of it because they're too prideful, they're too set in their ways. Um, they love the things of this world and they're afraid if they give it all up they're not going to be happy. They're afraid to accept Jesus into their hearts because you know then they're going to stop loving their stuff. To, they think that they're satisfied but they're really miserable and unhappy. Trust me, I know people that are miserable, they, they think they have all that they ever wanted, but uh, really, they, they're not happy one bit. They can tell themselves that they're happy, they can tell themselves that their actions are justified, but they can't lie to Jesus. Because what is Jesus? Jesus is truth. And you got to remember that. So, um, two things. Stay awake. Stay alert. That's actually three things. And um, be looking for that great outpouring. Um, don't be one of those people that is on the sidelines that are just watching it. Please, be a part of it. Um... Don't be like those people that are deceived that, you know, they got all that they ever wanted and that, you know, they're they're completely satisfied and they're eternally happy when really they're just miserable um, and they're going to regret not being a part of it. I'll see you guys later. Um, may Jesus bless you.